we spoke about audience buying, and I think that it's, can, it speaks to the, the theme because we're connecting audiences directly with brands. Where in the past, we used to advertise to broad target audiences, but now uh, we are able to, to directly uh, advertise to individuals who are interested in brands, so that there's that direct connection. The future of the marketing world is around digital first and understanding the digital consumer, and understanding what they're doing, what their needs are, what their interactions are, so that we can not just tailor digital messages, but we can also then craft our traditional media channels as well to focus in on that. So digital gives us the ability to be far more selective, far more accurate, and provide messages to consumers that are a lot more relevant than, than you see in other media. And I think that trend is going to go from what we think of today as digital and into addressable television and into digital radio and other channels where you're going to see a lot more tailoring and a lot more personalization and a lot more relevance for consumers because the way marketers are interacting with them is, is, is with the desire to give consumers what they're looking for. I think our advice to marketers now is, is to start experimenting with audience buying. Um, so rather than buy the traditional way, which is buy, use content as a proxy for, uh, for audience, now buy directly, uh, buy audiences directly and, and start experimenting with that and, and, and start understanding the efficiencies that could be gained. Well, I think we've worked with a number of clients that have got extremely powerful results. I mean, we had a, a quick serve restaurant uh, company that worked with us and one of the things they were doing was an extremely high volume marketing campaign. They were basically, based on time of day largely, when people were likely to eat, they were serving out huge volumes of messages to all sorts of different audiences in, in many different channels. And what we found was that in 80% of cases, that all that money was being used for was to reacquire existing customers. They, they were going to they were going to buy from this brand anyway. And what we were able to do is craft a strategy which allowed, enabled them to understand which which audiences were their existing customers, which audiences were potential new customers and focus their marketing dollars where they wanted to and have the right messages. And that was extremely effective for them because we focused most of their effort onto the 20% that were prospective new clients. And we were able to change the messaging strategy for the 80% very effectively. So that was very meaningful for me.